Hey Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Mozilla Firefox has just received an update, which is the first point release that's rolled out for version 126. And this latest update rolled out a short while ago today on the 28th of May. So to double check, as always, we head to our main menu, help about Firefox. And this process will force the update if it hasn't done so already. Now the latest version in bold is 126.0.1. .1. So we're dealing with our first point release in this latest stable version. And we have four fixes that have rolled out. And I'm just going to mention these um, because they're really taking place under the hood. And one of them is for Mac OS and one of them is for Linux. So the first of four fixes is they fixed an issue with reading tagged PDF documents in a screen reader. The second fix um, was that they fixed not displaying localized text for non-English US locales in the crash reported dialog box on Mac OS. Now that's actually an important fix if you are using the browser on Mac OS because when version 126 rolled out, that was something that Mozilla mentioned in the release notes that um, they would roll out a fix in a future release. So that wasn't patched with our version upgrade to 126. It's now been patched. Um, we're displaying localized text for non-English US locations in the crash reported dialog box on Mac OS. Um, that bug now has finally been addressed. And then the third fix is for Linux users. They fixed issues with drag and drop functionality on Linux. And then the fourth and final fix with this latest point release is they fixed an issue causing high GPU memory usage on certain versions of AMD cards. So if you have been experiencing that running an AMD card on your system, then that should be patched. And over and above that, there's um, no new features or any tweaks and adjustments or front-facing features. And as mentioned, that 126.0.1 point release update rolled out a little bit earlier today on the 28th of May. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.